Transformers Robots in Disguise 2015 Warrior Class Bludgeon. Bludgeon's alt mode is a futuristic or Cybertronian tank. The tank itself looks quite fierce, though the different colors cause the look to break up slightly. His tank treads don't move, being molded solidly in plastic. Instead, there are four small wheels on the bottom that allow him to roll along fairly well. The tank turret will rotate a full 360 degrees, and the double barrels can pivot up and down. Of note is that silver paint on the barrels and sides of the treads that I wish Hasbro would use more of. It's really striking. Lastly, Bludgeon's robot mode weapon, a sword, can store atop the turret if you so desire. Really, he's a great little tank all around, and I'm giving his alt mode a score of 8. Changing Bludgeon to robot mode isn't overly complicated. There is a rather interesting transformation step in changing the tank treads into the robot legs, where part of the treads fold in on themselves. The transformation is quick and fun, and it gets a score of 7.5. Bludgeon's robot mode is rather well done, evoking the Generation 1 Pretender Bludgeon toy. Especially of note is the skull face being very menacing and a little bit unique among Transformers characters. The colors work much better here than they did in his alt mode, where they pick out detail on the toy rather than break up the look. The only odd looking piece on the figure is the part that makes up the front of the tank, which now hangs off his... posterior. Of course, it's not too noticeable if you display your figures facing forward on your shelves like I do. Bludgeon comes with a sword accessory done up in that awesome looking silver paint, and it fits snugly in either hand. Coming across as a Decepticon warrior to reckon with, Bludgeon's robot mode gets a score of 8.5. All in all, Bludgeon can articulate quite nicely. Head will rotate all the way around, shoulders are pinned to give them outward movement, and there's a bicep swivel there too. His elbows bend a full 90 degrees on what appears to be a fake ratcheting joint. There's a waist swivel! Ball joints in the hips, as well as a swivel here too, allow for a wide range of movement. Add to that a knee bend that goes beyond 90 degrees and you'll certainly be able to get him into plenty of poses. I'm giving articulation a score of 8. There's no gimmick going on here beyond the ability of the robot to convert into a tank. As such, I'll give this category a standard score of 8. Bludgeon's overall score is an 8. Old mode is looking battle ready, transformation is on the easy side, and that's okay. Robot mode is properly menacing, and articulation is nothing to dismiss. There's not much gimmick going on here at all, but there doesn't need to be. Recommended. Bludgeon is one of those Transformers figures where the story behind it is a little complicated. He's a repaint of Robots in Disguise 2015 Blastwave, who himself was a retool of Robots in Disguise 2015 Megatronus. Two, he's an homage to G1 Bludgeon's Pretender Shell, as well as the inner robot's alt mode. Robots in Disguise 2015 has given us plenty of warrior class figures, with a few standouts among them, of which Bludgeon is certainly one. It's just a pity that we are getting toys like this at the end of the line, instead of closer to its initial waves.